Hi everyone. Today we've got a demo on switching loss. So for our setup, we've got a voltage source, we've got an oscilloscope, and we've got a circuit that's been designed to help us look at the voltage and current of a MOSFET as we turn it on and off. So that's what we're probing right here, our switch voltage and current. So to get started, let's give our circuit some voltage. All right, now over here on the oscilloscope, this blue waveform is our switch voltage and this yellow waveform is our switch current. So we can see right here, we've turned our switch on, its voltage falls and its current rises. And then over here, we've turned our switch off, its current falls and its voltage rises again. Now let's zoom in on that turn on transient. All right, so here we're turning the switch on. And so if we assume that that on signal occurs right about here, current starts to rise pretty quickly, but it takes the voltage quite a while before it falls. So there's a time period for which the switch's voltage and its current are both non-zero. That amounts to overlap loss. Now, another source of loss on here is the fact that the switch's voltage was non-zero when it was turned on. And so that means its capacitances were storing energy when it was turned on. And that's another source of loss. So you can imagine that if this is occurring each time we turn our switch on, and we're turning our switch on hundreds of thousands of times per second, this could amount to a non-negligible loss for our circuit. So it's this sort of behavior that we try to minimize with techniques like soft switching. All right, that's it.